What if the most powerful telescope in history has just shown us something we were never meant to see? What if everything we've ever believed about the origin of our universe, about time, space, and reality itself, is collapsing under the weight of new evidence? The James Webb Space Telescope, designed to peer into the earliest light of the cosmos, has now delivered data so unsettling that a Nobel Prize-winning physicist has broken his silence with one simple, terrifying message. This is not our universe. What exactly did the James Webb Telescope find at the very edge of everything? And why are scientists warning that it could rewrite the very foundation of cosmology as we know it? Keep watching, because what you're about to hear changes everything. In a corner of the sky filled with ancient light, the James Webb Telescope captured what looked like a simple yellow splotch. But when astronomers took a closer look, their assumptions collapsed. That tiny glowing blob wasn't just another galaxy. It was the most distant galaxy ever seen, formed just 290 million years after the supposed birth of the universe. But here's the impossible part. It's too massive, too bright, and too evolved to have formed so soon after the Big Bang. By our current theories, there simply wasn't enough time or matter to form galaxies like this in the early universe. And yet, here it is. And it's not alone. Webb has now found dozens more just like it. Each one is a cosmic paradox, breaking every rule we thought we understood about the early universe. Scientists began to dig deeper, and what they found was even stranger. Some of these early universe objects aren't just massive, they're completely foreign to anything we've seen before. Unlike normal galaxies, which convert about 10% of their gas into stars, Webb discovered at least three galaxies that have turned 100% of their matter into stars. No gas, no dust, just pure blazing starlight. That's not just unusual. It's impossible according to every existing model of galaxy formation. So now scientists are asking a far more terrifying question. What if these aren't galaxies at all? What if we're not seeing the early universe, but something else entirely? A structure from another dimension? A remnant of a previous cosmos? Or an intrusion from another universe altogether? To understand why this is shaking cosmology to its core, we need to talk about the Hubble sphere and the observable universe. The farther away an object is, the faster it moves away from us due to the expansion of space. At a certain point, called the Hubble sphere, galaxies are moving away from us faster than the speed of light. Common sense says we shouldn't be able to see those galaxies, yet we can. That's because space itself is expanding, and the boundary of what we can see keeps stretching, 